Hey y'all, welcome back to Cleaning Gratefully and welcome if you're new here. I'm so grateful you clicked on this video and if you want to see me transform my under sink area from this to this, then be sure you're subscribed and keep on watching. I'll talk you through the whole process to get under the sink decluttered, clean, and organized and I'll have all the products I use linked in the description box for you so let's listen to some good music and comment below if you're wanting to organize under your sink for the new year happy new year by the way we are now in 2023 yay let's get the area cleaned up by vacuuming and wiping it down and then i'll put a white liner down to protect the bottom shelf here and since it's white it'll bright up brighten up the space and this part of the video was actually filmed in October of 2022 and actually if we go back a little bit further I had a decluttering series on my living gratefully channel in the fall of 2021 and that's when I started decluttering under here and so if you want to see that where it all began the link to that one is in the description box and here is a thumbnail up on the screen and in the card so you can find it easily but yeah I, this was like a year and a half process I started decluttering and started thinking Thinking about what kind of containers I wanted to have under here then I bought some containers in the fall of 2022 and now we are in January of 2023 and I'm showing you the final product so it was a long process but sometimes it takes a while here's a little clip of that decluttering video and then here we go with the white liner under here Now I'll start putting some of the organizational containers in here. I had started gathering some of the items from Amazon and from the home edit from Walmart and I'll have everything I use linked below if you want to get you some organizational items for under your sink and since this was in October of 2022 we utilized this for a few months before revamping it again which you'll see here in a little bit which I think was kind of nice because then we could decide what we liked and what it did what we didn't like and then how we could improve the space even more so I'm showing you the whole process This is the interim result, but wait, it gets a lot better when I buy a few more containers and by using it for a few months, like I said, we decided what we liked and didn't like and what we could do even better. Let's take everything out again. Let's wipe it down and get this thing right. I'm so proud of how it turned out as a final result, so I can't wait for you guys to see how everything looks. We had everything we needed You put me aside 
We did like how the grocery bags are contained in a space here by having a top on there so that you don't have to pull out a drawer or anything. You can just use one hand and reach in there and get one. And by adding the turntable, it really is nice and makes all the sprays easy to get to. I like these wash rags from Walmart. I use these to clean baseboards in particular and also like they're the kind of rag I reach for if I'm going to clean the front porch with a bowl of dish soap and water in the hose. I bought some white fire microfiber towels on Amazon. And we have a stock of dish tabs now. I don't think we're gonna run out for a while. All my thoughts are running, running around inside my head. Emotions keep coming, they're keeping me from thinking straight. Thought it would be different when I got my things in place. Stuck in this commotion, how come I ain't past this yet? I wanna me that be somebody else, another me that doesn't need your help. But if I'm honest, I don't think we got it. I try to change the things you never like, try to make this better, make this right, but we're the same, even though I change. I'll use the containers that the white dish tabs came in from Target to contain a few items so that it's aesthetically pleasing because these containers are white and gray and they can hide, you know, stuff that's not aesthetically pleasing. So I just kind of reused those containers and I, that's a good tip too. If I can't be with you, I'd rather be by myself. No, I can't lie. I don't want 
Okay guys, here is the final result. I hope you like it as much as I do. I can add labels later if I want to, but the clear containers make it easy to tell what's in them. And if you're new here, I'd love to have you subscribe to join my amazing YouTube family. I am so blessed to have the best subscribers, always supportive and encouraging to me and to others. And you won't want to miss out on all the cleaning, decluttering, and organizing I have coming in 2023. And to my returning subscribers, thank you for all of your support and love since I started this channel in February of 2022. We are approaching a year of cleaning gratefully and I am constantly encouraged by you so thank you so much for being you and for taking your time to watch my videos and I'll see you next week for more cleaning motivation love you guys bye